Kevin, how do you me. want me to approach my man? Hey, boo, why would I cheat my partner? No, but you're you're not answering okay, my okay, 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 let me go there. Let me I can help you answer that. No, 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 no. Let me go there. Let me go there. Uh-huh. Let me go there. Uh-huh. Okay. Number two, why women cheat? You want to know? Uh, I want that one. <laughs> Seems a good one. Hi guys, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. And if you are new here, Karibu Sana. Thank you for taking time to click on this specific video. And please don't forget to subscribe and keep it here with Alice Amy. And for my existing subscribers, oh my god, thank you so much for the support. And in today's video, oh, I have a guest. Yeah. Welcome. <laughs> Yeah, so uh-huh. introduce yourself. Okay, my name is Kevin. They call me Kev, and uh, I'm also a fellow YouTuber, but that is topic for another time. Maybe we can get into the topic, the DC topic. Mm, okay, guys, this is Kevin, and uh, he's a YouTuber. He's postponing the YouTube part of it, but let me still <laughs> introduce it. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm going to leave his uh, channel in the in the comment section. The comment Please section. take time, go watch his videos. He has amazing content. Tell people what you do. Uh, generally, I'm a presenter, but I do most of the time African content, the African perspective on issues mainly. Yeah. Yeah. So if you're interested in learning more about the African culture, about African stories. You can always come to the African passport, but we'll still leave the I think the link for the comments. Yeah, we are going to leave the uh, link in the comment section, and I'm also going to leave it here, just in case you're trying to search and see like, oh, did I miss out something? Yes. Yeah. So please go support Kevin on his channel, and uh, Team Emmy, don't disappoint me. Because go in big numbers <laughs> so yeah so kevin in today's video yes. we are talking about forgiving your partner if you found them cheating and the question is yes. would you forgive your partner if you found them cheating and uh why i had to bring this specific topic is because there are so many relationships yeah. that have failed yeah uh, because of cheating yeah true there are so many marriages that, yeah. have, that have failed because of cheating true. because of cheating yeah and uh that thing it really disturbs my mind mm. uh and maybe on in today's uh uh in today's or on this video yeah maybe someone out there will be able to pick out one or one or, or two, two things uh, because uh maybe even what, what you're talking about has yes. happened to you uh, it is very common by the way uh, it happens almost to everyone every day so yeah. today we are talking about the man's perspective on um, cheating. Okay, or I think generally. generally because it's a weight topic, but we're going to just click one or two no on, on both sides. Since you are a man I'll and I'm a woman it. here, ah. <laughs> maybe I can be able to <laughs> give my opinion on what yeah. I think. Yes. And maybe also tell us what you think. No, okay. no problem. So let's start with men. Men, men, men. We women, you always say men are the problem. Uh-huh. And uh, men are always saying women, we are the problem. Women are actually the problem. But uh, in most cases, mm. uh, I was discussing this uh, very question with a few people. Yes. Women, of course. Mm. And uh, some of them were saying uh, when you are a woman, cheat, yeah. men easily don't give second chances that's true but when a man cheats they expect you to forgive them should i explain why explain okay <laughs> explain explain let me tell you <laughs> women who are created to share look for your loving creatures you can be able to be in a home with another woman and uh, just survive i mean look i'll just give it with an african perspective mm. look at our grandfathers look at like all the way from back, let's now uh, leave the westernization. Mm-hmm. Yeah? Mm-hmm. From back then, one man could even have nine wives. Exactly. That and in fact, mm-hmm. if you had uh, many wives, you are considered rich. At times, you are considered even the, like you are the topmost, wow. the chiefs and the kings 
or had a lot of wives. Mm, mm. And no day did one woman come and say, Yo, you're cheating on me. Yeah, you're cheating on me. <laughs> because they were comfortable. They were okay with that. I agree, Kevin. Yeah. I now, agree. Mm. Let's come back to this time. This our time. time. Um, yes, yes, yes. Our current time and long time ago, the only thing that is different, mm. or maybe the only thing that uh, makes this look a bit old is because men nowadays don't have resources. Okay, what do you mean by resources? Like long time ago. Mm-hmm. Oh, like this, in terms of yeah, money and You know, uh, at wealth. that time, wealth was considered in terms of livestock, cattle, land. You know, it was yeah. not physical cash. Mm. So most likely our grandfathers and our those people from the old time, mm. they were having huge chunks of land. Mm. They could mm. easily subdivide these lands to every wife and their kids. Mm. And they'd live Happily, Happily, uh, happy. Yes, yeah. So right now, all of us, we are a bit looking for this money and stuff. And a lot of men don't have money. So me, what I'd advise you men, if you don't have money, stay with money. <laughs> if you have money, you should get some. Why am I okay, saying this? Okay. Mm. Even if you, you ask a lot of women, they're yeah. willing. They're willing to be in a relationship. Uh, I mean, to be with a man with who a has man. a lot of other ladies. Mm. As long as he can provide, as long as my kids are not sleeping hungry. Personally, I think I can't stand a cheating partner. No, we are. Uh, okay, continue. Sorry. I can't. I can't stand a cheating partner. Mm-hmm. And uh, you mentioned about money. Yeah. Could that be one of the reasons as to why we are having so many failed marriages, so many failed relationships, uh, that uh, maybe. Forget money, they feel like they can. But also, there are people who are who don't even have money, but they're cheating. That, that's why I've uh, I've already advised the men. Them. Uh, I'm telling you, <laughs> if you're broke, don't get any other woman. Stay mm. with your woman. I feel so bad uh, to see people. Mm. They have begun life together. Yeah. They have gone to one year, yes. two years together, three years together. Mm. Four, five along the way, mm. the, uh, the marriage is failed. Yeah. Not uh, because of cheating. Mm. What other thing do you think that uh, causes marriage in homes or, or not causes um, cheating? Okay, no problem. Either. I think I'll be able to explain that. I'll give both perspective of a man why a man can cheat and why a woman can cheat. Yes. I think I should start with a man. Mm. Men most of the time cheat. Ladies, hear me out. Men most of the time cheat because they are not finding something at home. Not food. Uh, sorry, that I miss. I quoted it wrongly. A man Make will cheat. Make it clear for us to understand, yeah. please, because they are going to come to you in Let the comment say section. Let me directly, Alice. <laughs> okay. Alice, a man will cheat mm-hmm. if he most likely doesn't find peace at home. I agree with you. Most men here who are having a peaceful relationship. If I come to you as my wife, mm. I should be able to feel at home. Yeah, because most likely I've been having a bad day. Mm. Mm. Uh, like life is never fair to every man, uh, to to men actually. Yeah, that is true. All of them. We have mm. to fight every day to prove ourselves to a man. So when we are coming back home, we need to have peace. So as long as you're not providing peace, even if you're doing everything else, even if you're a good cook, mm. your what will still cheat on you. Because let me say this, mm. there's no better whatever. So it's not that a man is looking for better a better... Better what? Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's not that a man there's is no better for, uh, what? Eh? Than yours. Mm. Yeah? But mm. this man will try to go and look it out because you have proved to him that... You're already not good enough at home. Okay, so what I'm learning from you is... Mm. But before I point out those points, mm. I don't want to accept that women get the problems. No, no, no. I... But uh, what I'm, I'm trying to learn from Kevin is, mm. uh, first of all, uh, men, yeah. sorry, women. Women, sometimes we are too much. Yeah. Sometimes we are too much. True. Uh, a man comes back home, mm. Uh, maybe you had a bad day, mm-hmm. or maybe uh, someone brought some rumor to you, mm-hmm. or maybe someone say uh, someone's not even sure of what they 
came to give to you. Yeah. A man comes back home, you're grooming, you don't want to say anything to him, you don't want to say hi to him, you don't want to even speak to him. Yeah. And it's it's worse for women who are silent. Yeah, true. Uh, silent, I mean women who don't speak out. You know, when uh, when uh, when uh, when I was growing up, my aunties used to tell me one point number one: never let anything go the next day. Uh -huh. Never let anything go the next day. So if you fight, Meaning you fight today. that uh, <laughs> if I go to know that uh -huh. my partner. Uh -huh. Let me just use a name. Which name? Sam. Mm -hmm. That if I go to know that uh, uh, me and Sam, yeah. we are having an issue or I'm mad about anything, mm -hmm. when he comes back home, I should not be gloomy. I should, yeah. okay, I should not be happy, but I should, of course, I know you can't control anger, yeah. but on the same note, you, you try to show him that, you know, you are like, Try to be a wife. Mm. Let him come home. Welcome him. Yeah. Serve him dinner. Let him shower. Mm. Go and you know some women even show it to their kids. Yeah, true. Which is so bad. Mm. Go to your bedroom. Mm. Before Sam sleeps, I have to tell him. You know what, baby? We have to talk about something. Not unless he's not giving me mm. time to talk to him. Yeah. We have to talk about something. Can we can we talk? Yes. And this 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 is not right and I'm not happy with it. Yeah. The only problem the only problem that uh, most men have mm -hmm. is ego. Uh, Even when they are they have done something they don't want to accept. Uh -huh. Am I wrong? Be like, be like, the way you smile, the way you smile. Ah. No, no, I'm just. Even, even when they do something wrong, they don't want to accept. Even, uh, but if you got someone who under, who understands or who mm. accepts that person, you have you can be able to resolve such uh, problems and then you go, you move on. No, you, you I just, mm. let me cut you short on that. Mm. If we talk about ego, there's ego and there's respect. Mm. There's a way you present yourself to your man with whatever idea, whatever thing you want to say. Mm. That a man can't agree to because first of all, us men we are, we are built to be respected. So every time, of course, our ego will be here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's also a way that how do you approach your man when mm. he's wrong? Mm -hmm. That's also another thing. Mm -hmm. A lot of ladies come. <laughs> That's the issue about ego. But as long as you can be able to, uh, uh, I mean, here in Kenya, there is mm. one couple I do love so much. The one from Kurugende. I don't know if you know. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I know those guys. Go look at that wife. The way she handles herself. Mm. Even if the husband is not there, that woman, like. She's she's, uh, she's peaceful. Uh, you understand? Yeah. You feel good energy when you are with that woman, even mm, if it's mm, not your wife. Mm, you feel mm. that this woman respects the husband and everything. Mm, mm, so mm. the ego part, yes, as men we do a lot of problems. I mean, we cause a lot of problems, but it also depends on how you come and approach us. Let me take you back. Kevin, how do you about. want me to approach my man? Hey, boo, uh, guys, yeah, I'm that, here to learn. On that, Alice should grow this channel until <laughs> she's able to 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 call William Kurugenzi. <laughs> William Kurugenzi, come and talk to her. You teach them how hey. to do that. Because me, I don't know, honestly, I'm a man. Yeah? Okay. Yes. But let's go back to the point. There's a point we are giving. Okay. Why do women cheat? Okay. Oh. Personally, I feel uh, why women cheat is mm -hmm. first of all, it is care. You know, you said women we are yeah. vulnerable. You say something about yeah, women. women were meant to be loved. We are meant to be loved. Yeah, we are meant to be taken care of. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, most times, yeah, I am assuming mm -hmm. because personally, I don't. I don't. It's not. I don't like it when someone cheats, mm -hmm. and same to me. 
Why would I cheat my partner? No, but say, uh, okay, 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 let me go what there. Let me <laughs> I can help you answer that. No, 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 let me, let me, let me go uh -huh. there. Let me go there. Uh -huh. Okay, point number one uh -huh. is when you're not providing to her. Thank you. Point number two. Can uh -huh. I add point number two? Uh -huh. I can add and this is very sensitive, by the way. The first one, not providing. Not providing. Uh -huh. There are men who don't even pay a woman's bill, not even hair. You don't even know how she made her hair. Uh -huh. But every day she makes her hair. Every day uh -huh. she uh, changes clothes. Okay, yes. fine, she's working, uh -huh. but be concerned. Once in a while, ask her where did you get the money. Mm -hmm. At least let her tell you. Okay, for, uh, I mean, for my salary, I was able to do this and this and this and this. Yeah. But what have you done for her? Mm. No, no, you see. So, uh, not the first one is providing. Providing. Mm. Number two, why women cheat? Uh, you want to know? Uh, I want that one. <laughs> Seems a good one. Guys. I think I know it, but uh, I want guys, you to say it. You need to agree with me on this in the comment section. Uh -huh. Let's have a conversation. <laughs> Number two, why women cheat uh -huh. is if they're not being getting satisfied. You know what, what I mean by not being satisfied. Mm. Uh, some of you guys, hey, I don't even, I don't know, I but uh, yeah, they're not. Some of some yeah, some, 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 some men are not good are in what them. they do, mm. but for them they feel they are good. Now to mm. make it worse is that. If you're lucky, you get someone who will tell you, here it is not right, but here it is right. If you get someone who doesn't, uh, who doesn't care, yeah. they'll just keep silent. That's true. Now, because in most times you're going to find that because you're providing, mm. they'll just be there and go find sex somewhere else. Fish. But hey, okay, that's a if, uh, yes. And <laughs> <laughs> go find hey, my else. man, where if, are you at? <laughs> if, uh, if uh, you are both not providing mm -hmm. and uh, and are not, not good, good in again. that in that mm -hmm. line, mm -hmm. and she's still there, it means there's something that is keeping her there. So what's keeping her there? That's what I want to know. That's what I don't know. But most probably, those are the two most so reasons. My That's men, why they are saying that cheat. the main reasons women cheat is because you are not providing. You don't care about how she gets smart, how she's looking for you. You don't care. Maybe you are not providing at all. And the second thing is if you are not good in second. You, okay. Uh, <laughs> to him, he may feel like he's good, um, but... Maybe to me, like you don't satisfy me. But tell this a good question is why can't you tell this guy mm. to put that? That is now why I it. say it. some mm. men have ego. Mm. You, mm. I, I can even assume of how I can start telling you, baby. Mm. This to, to me, I feel you're not doing this right, mm. and of course you're going to give me mother around, like. No, no, no. You know the thing is this, sir. Huh? There is nothing you uh, can tell me. Let me let me try to answer that. A lot of men might have problems with you telling him how to do it because he'll be like, where did you learn? I, where did you learn? No, no, where like... Where did you learn? Ah, you see, see, Lazima, like, it's not Lazima, like what? Lazima, <laughs> Guys, what? can you support me she here? She can't can you? answer because the big question is where did she learn? <laughs> where? See, I know there's someone who's supporting me on this. Me, I'm supporting you. It is true. <laughs> okay, the director is saying it is She's, true. The director is saying it is true. Okay, but Kevin, uh, we've, no, we've, we've talked I, about... I don't disagree. It's only that I'm giving the man's perspective of the same. A lot of men might have problems with it because mm. they believe they're the king. And what well, you're trying to say that... Right. Uh, you I could not get to no, end up in Mm. That's all as a man you step up. Not so, uh, so our so. director is saying, man, you have to step up, at your complaints. Do okay. what you have to do. Okay, so Kevin, your reason is uh, the reason why men don't cheat is peace. Yeah, it's what, actually, my dear it's women. Something. Can we have peace in your in our homes? Mm. I know uh, they normally say marriage there is nothing like perfection. Yeah. There will always be as they are winding up the video. Yeah. Uh, there is nothing like perfection. There will be uh, arg uh, arguments, mm. uh, maybe today or tomorrow, but 
these are things that you both of us can work out. Mm-hmm. These are things that you and your partner can work out. Yeah. Uh, just try to do what you're supposed to do as women. Kevin, me I'm focusing on that part. Peace. Yeah, true. That's Peace. true. That's of true. which I agree with you because um, besides... Okay, there are men who are cheaters by default. Like, that no is who they are. a cheater by default. <laughs> no, we'll like, that... Okay, I'll we'll bring invite, that... Yes. I'll invite you to my podcast. It's okay, it's okay. I tell you, why, man, why men all of a sudden become cheaters? Most likely, if you find... Uh, that's for the next. Yes, but he also remember, and on this we are talking about mar- mar- marriage and also relationships. Yeah. Okay, for for relationships, maybe I can agree with you. No, but let for me tell marriage, you. Really? you. See, if you find a guy who is cheating, most likely this is a broken man. And the reason why this guy is broken is because some woman broke him. Hey, must you bring your problems to our relationships? Thank you. The past is then, gone. Uh, okay, if I also ladies, bring the same thing to ladies, you if I down. bring the same thing <laughs> to our our relationship, <laughs> is it going to work out? That's why that's why before you get into a relationship or marriage, it's really important that you get to know someone. Yeah, you get to know someone. What are the past relationships? How far was the heartache? Because mm-hmm. there's someone who has not healed. Most likely it's coming to you just to test the waters oh. and you move to the another. That's why unafuk mtafute mtu mwenye amesha maliza mwenye hata ako ready to let you go because he doesn't feel any his own feelings mixed and mixed up. But now if you get a boy mwenye ametoka kwa heartbreak you this guy he wants revenge and ataka most likely to test every and any woman in town. Anyway, you must be right or you're right in that no. line. Yeah. But uh, as we are summarizing up this topic, mm. uh, we've talked about, of course, it's a very wide topic yeah. and there are things that we've left out that are maybe are much more important than what we've mentioned. Yeah, true. But uh, we are just trying to give our opinion. Maybe even mm. you can be able to relate if you, we were in our past relationship mm. and maybe the reason as to why you're seeing is because uh, someone was cheating on you and you yeah. had to walk away. Mm-hmm. Please leave a comment and tell us what are you trying to what have you learned from this video mm-hmm. and uh if or what can you what are you able to share with us? Maybe there's someone else who is going through something yeah. and maybe they're afraid to walk away, but they feel they can make their relationship work. Yeah. What can you advise them to do mm-hmm. to keep their relationships work? Yeah, let's have a conversation in the comment section. Kevin, yes. it was nice to have you. And I want to bring you back. Uh, my people. I'll only come here when you are <laughs> at 1.5. At, at 1.5. 1. 1. 1. 1. 1. 1. Yes. Right 1. now 5. we are currently at 1.3. So Ali Semi at 1.5 subscribers. Guys, yeah, you subscribe back. because he has given me his, his points. And... As you can see, we've been having a, a no, a yes, a no, agree, disagree. Yes. So let's bring him back on this channel and let him share with us more wisdom and uh, maybe we can be able to learn more about uh, the same or any other topic yeah, on this channel. Mm-hmm. It has been your host, Alex Amy, and my guest. I'm Kev. And Kev, please, and please, don't forget to go to his channel it is yeah. called the african post i'm leaving it here african pulse, pulse pod. pod yeah so do not forget to subscribe uh watch videos tell him you're from team emmy 